let's, uh, let's turn to another issue, which is the whole MNA guidelines, uh, mm -hmm. which has been talked about for quite a while now, but we don't seem to be seeing them out there as, as the law. Uh, can you tell us where do we stand on those guidelines? Because a lot of the consolidation which is being planned or proposed is not happening because these guidelines are not coming out. So we will bring them out very quickly. Can you give us some contours, broader contours of what these would entail? Uh, that is, that's a bit difficult to say at this stage. Uh, but yes, we will, I think we will, we will, we will, we will come out with that in, in a very, very short time. And certainly, we, the way we look at it, uh, and I have said this earlier as well, that we see, you know, merger and acquisition, spectrum sharing, spectrum trading, unified licenses, higher FDI uh, limits for uh, telecom sector, all these as as those pieces which when all of them put in place would actually lead the sector to a sustainable growth path. So we want all of them to be put in place. Some of them we can actually go into the nut, bowls, nut and bolts of them and we can actually do the whole uh, detailing of this complete with the guideline on how it will be done. On some others it may be possible at this stage to come out with very categorical commitment that this would be done. And I would say that we need to kind of tie up all these loose ends to the extent possible before the next round of auction to be able to realize a good price. You believe that your guidelines will facilitate consolidation, mergers and acquisitions? I'm, I'm asking you because you would be talking Actually, to a lot of the players. Mm -hmm. They would be coming and meeting you, sharing their thoughts with you. Do you think that this sector is ripe for consolidation and once your guidelines come, you could see that happening? Well, I would say that that is for industry to take a call because there, is, there are a lot many things which go into it. What I would like to, uh, my major concern is consolidation per se is not my objective. My sure, objective is that, yeah. sustained growth of the sector. And my objective is affordable uh, telecom facilities spread to all the areas, including rural areas in the country. Now, it is for the, and, and, and for me, it is necessary to put in place those set of policies which enable this to happen, which makes it possible for the most efficient operator to be able to kind of extend these facilities to others and, in a way, therefore, maximize the gain for the economy. And in that sense, I would say that uh, we will put in place those guidelines and uh, to the extent possible that there are, there are some who are much more efficient than others, I think certainly they will take this opportunity when we give those guidelines for merger and acquisition, they will take this opportunity for, 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 for some uh, consolidation in the sector. The last date I read, sir, was 15th October. Is that a feasible timeline you're working with or it could get extended? Well, I guess it might get extended, I, uh, but as I told you that we are looking all, uh, at all of these things. I would like that when we go for auction, we should have all these, these bits in place, uh, all, all of them. And you're very confident January auctions yes, will happen? Sure. Absolutely. Which is why you've set such a tight Absolutely. deadline of 29. Absolutely. I don't think very, you, one would hear very often that Telecom Commission in its meeting decided the date for the next meeting and that actually sets a timeline for everyone. So I think uh, uh, everyone uh, recognizes that this is, this is the time by which we will have to, to work. And is, and is reforming? Mm -hmm. uh, a foregone conclusion? Is that something on which both TRA and Telecom Commission agreed? I, I, I think uh, re-farming is probably is, 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 is too strong a word to use. <laughs> in, You're changing in, in the, the words. Huh? <laughs> in the present context, I think you are referring to 900 megahertz. Yes. I think 900 we have to see, we have asked for some, uh, uh, for some, some clarity, there are some existing decisions, we had made some provision in the last auction, 
So we need to kind of keep all these things in mind. And I think I would not like to venture uh, uh, at, at this point of time to say what is going to be the final outcome.